So I don't check my Facebook messages very much, especially from people I don't know. I actually just noticed one from over a year ago. It goes like this. Are these your light switches? I was looking at your Linux videos and got onto your site and played a game that looked good. But the point is, I can search through your index on your website. Plus, I see all your ports and what type of server you're running. It truly is hard to tell when people are joking sometimes. He goes on to say, I'm not going to hack you. I'm an enthusiast of computers and cybersecurity. Just letting you know I can see what lights are on or off. So for those of you who are not familiar with this, I did a video a while back uh, showing this little interface I made. He's referring to this, this little switch setup I have. And for those of you who are curious, you can go to filmsbychris.com forward slash scripts forward slash outlets forward slash switches. And it's true. If you click those buttons, you can turn my lights on and off in my house. You can even look at the code that controls it. But anyone with two seconds of experience would see this. 192.168.1.11. So it is true, 100%, that interface will control lights in my house. If you are on my local network. If you're not on my local network, then it's not going to do anything. It's going to send a signal to that IP address that, which might exist on your network, but not do anything because you're not running the same server I am. Although I gave a tutorial on how to set that server up. As far as seeing the index of my website, what server I'm running and what ports are open, if you go to filmsarychris.com, click on software, and then here you can click on scripts, it's actually gonna bring you to an index of scripts on my site. This is here on purpose. You're supposed to be able to go through that. That's why I put it there. And if you're curious as what type of server I'm running, I'm running an Apache server on Debian, and port 80 is open for the web server. None of this is private information whatsoever. What server I'm running, what ports I have open, of course that stuff is publicly available. It's a publicly facing web server. And in case you're wondering, let me do a little Nmap scan for you. Here's the results of the Nmap scan. I have a web server running and it's running MySQL database. Honestly, I don't think this person's trying to be malicious. I think that maybe they are trying to help me, but at the same time, I think they're trying to sound cooler than they are. Uh, clearly, none of the stuff that he is concerned about uh, is security issues, and anyone who's done any type of networking uh, or is a computer enthusiast uh, would realize this. Sadly, this is the world we live in. Uh, there's many people who work in the tech industry who are IT professionals, think this way. They, they don't understand security whatsoever, and things that are not security issues are, are big to them, and then things that are really security issues, they just gloss over. Uh, and this is a problem for a lot of businesses, and it makes life a lot more difficult. Personally, I think that's one of the reasons why on certain operating systems like Windows, you have OK buttons for security. Or on Android devices where it's all or nothing. You have no access to some of your own personal files unless you root it, and in which case everybody has access to them because there's no password for root. This is a sad state. Uh, I appreciate your concern sending me a message like that, but at the same time, Maybe you should learn a little bit more before you start trying to educate other people. And don't pass yourself off as a professional or an enthusiast or whatever you want to call yourself. Now, I know I'm coming across kind of as a jerk in this video, and uh, that's because I am kind of a jerk. Uh, but in, in all honesty, uh, if you do see any security issues uh, with my website or any of the code I post, it's, it's very easy. I do use my web server for a lot of stuff, so it's very easy to forget to password protect something or push something to Git. Or, or even paste bin where I forget to move some personal information. And, and if you see something like that, definitely do let me know. I, I know that I'm, I'm giving this guy a hard time. Um, and that's just because it's like, it's just, I get messages like this sometimes where they're like, oh, there's security issues and it's stuff that isn't even remotely a security issue. But I don't wanna discourage you guys uh, from letting me know if you do see security issues on my website. So. I don't want to go too hard on this guy, and I do appreciate the concern. Uh, but it is one of those where it's like, I'm not sure if this guy is just messing with me because it is so silly to that you know what type of server I'm running and what ports are open, or that I... I now, if, if I had a index directory um, showing private stuff, yeah, that's an issue, but my scripts folder is designed to be shared. There's a link to it on my homepage. Um, yeah, so just... Let me know, and I'm sorry if I'm coming across a little harsh in this video on this guy, but I thank you all for watching, and I hope that you have a great day.